Are you gonna move or are you just gonna spend the night here, mate? Wait there, you can wait there, thank you. Well, hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Um, yeah, it's uh, kind of late on a Sunday night. I'm just coming back from my friend's house. We were watching a little bit of American football, NFL, AFC Championship game. Guess I see the Chief won. Um, congratulations to What's Up Bob, he's a big uh, Chiefs fan. They're going to the Super Bowl again, fourth time in five years. Well done, congratulations. Yes, I do watch uh, other sports, not just motorbikes. I, I do watch uh, uh, football or soccer, as the Americans would call it, or calcio, as the Italians would call it. Uh, I watch American football, uh, basically anything that has a ball. I don't, I don't know, it's something in my uh, in my makeup, in my DNA. My grandfather was the same. Uh, so I always enjoy watching a little bit of sports, cricket, baseball, basketball, volleyball, whatever it is. Earlier today I released a, a video where it was pretty much a fairly long rant, fairly long video. I was very much in trepidation uh, of releasing it because I didn't know how it was going to be received. Uh, I, I don't usually talk uh, politics and all that kind of bollocks on my channel, um, but it's something that it is, is part of me, it's, it's part of my nature of wanting to think about it, wanting to discuss it. Um, and it does uh, it does affect my feelings. I, I get uh, frustrated and angry with uh, with the way of the world, and I uh, should probably be more chill about it. But I do want to, you know, share thoughts and exchange ideas with other people, and I'm going to have a grown-up conversation. Um, and so I try. Uh, I was a bit afraid of how it was going to be received, but uh, so far. Uh, first few hours comments seem to have been mostly understanding supportive and positive uh, which is nice uh, I'm not sure whether that means I'm going to be doing more of that kind of stuff um, but uh, you know I just wanted to have it on record that it was it was no surprise but yeah London late on a Sunday night. Just be uh, not too bad for riding around. It's nice and empty. It is a bit uh, looking a bit wet, but I think that's just the uh, moisture with the colder temperatures. Uh, you gonna wait there? You gonna wait there? Thank you. So yeah, I mean, uh, uh, I have been thinking for a while that I, I want to say some stuff about topics. Um, which are can be seen as controversial or can be seen as boring yeah I've been thinking for a while because it, it's constantly in my mind I, I can't constantly think about the way of the world and what kind of world I'm leaving for my children and my descendants um, and there are some things that make me think harder and there are some things that make me angry and upset I don't like being taken advantage of and I think the UK population is being taken advantage of. In fact, the world's population is being taken advantage of. People are stealing from us. Uh, and our lives could be a lot better. But we've been tricked into not paying attention or into giving up. And that just allows the that kind of lack of engagement and alienation just uh, lets the powerful become more powerful and the rich become richer and we just become more and more destitute and enslaved but we are so easily divided uh, and, and the elite the rich and powerful play a very good game of uh, divide and conquer they divide us they make us fight each other they make us blame each other to distract from the real reason why things are shit. There are all choices, policy choices, directions from above that have led to the situation. But you know, we think it's boring to talk about it, and we don't want to talk about it because it's too hard to think, uh, and we have uh, more sort of immediate 
problems and considerations in front of our noses which means that we can't be concerned with the sort of background and underlying reasons why things are so shit and I, I don't particularly want to live like that or accept that which all is to say I don't want this video to be a bit of a rant but be warned there may be there may be rants coming up in other videos but there will continue to be a mixture I will talk about some motorcycle only stuff and maybe there will be some renty stuff that wasn't a cool bus that was not cool anyway another bit of sad news uh, came out earlier today um, my mate Phil Western Super Motor Vlogs seems to be uh, hinging his GoPro as it were and, and calling it a day with the channel I hope I hope that's not true I hope that's just a, a temporary state of emotion and I hope he continues to produce the videos that he does because they are pretty awesome and uh, if he doesn't and then I will be missing them especially around Halloween time but really I, I even I, I, I I haven't felt like creating a video for a while. Uh, I've had a few videos kind of queued up and um, in reserve uh, for a lean period and I have been sort of fairly busy with work. Um, so so that rent video was one that had been queued up for a few months. Um, it was filmed a while ago, early, earlier in 2023. Got released uh, uh, in January 2024. I don't know when this video is going to come out. Um, but I haven't felt like uh, I haven't felt, felt in the mood to go out and film and, and make a vlog or, or make a video. I have lots of ideas. I just haven't felt motivated and inspired. I've had other things to focus on: work, family, uh, etc. So that's that's kind of my my rationale and my explanation. But I am filming this now. I don't know when it's going to come out. Um, but in the meantime, uh, as always, I really appreciate you guys uh, who watch support and subscribe to the channel I really do uh, I want to thank you again We're climbing our way to a thousand subscribers and climbing your way to the sort of 4,000 watch hours which is awesome so thank you again I uh, hope you stick with it and I hope this uh, this little kind of adjustment uh, or, or slight change in, in content and direction doesn't upset you um, yet if it does then well I'm sorry this is my channel it's kind of my diary of my life and the things that affect me are going to be discussed but for now thank you very much again and it's new out and this world ain't bright won't accept it negative energy I expect it once it's in your mind, it's infectious So fight for your life and reject it You better give me space, I'm protective My address